High play. Yeah. High play, we shall uh, be okay. Uh, we'll give you a couple of minutes, we'll come back in. Bloody thing. We pay for top quality internet and then the fucking mixer continues to let you bloody down instead. Seriously. How's it going, Seven? Yeah, Thank seven. you for coming back, mate. Sorry about that. Reset stream again because the volume, there's audio syncing out. Complete and full. Thank you for that, host. Oh, you smashed K Pass, though. Brilliant, mate. Brilliant. Yeah, I know, but that doesn't make us look any better, though, does it, Doug, really, unfortunately? Here we are trying to do our best. The man boys fucking top quality super dick internet and then Mixer lets you down. You just can't win, can you? <laughs> so you got the Mixer or 2K trying to kill me this week? Yeah, one of the two, mate. One of the two. Anyway, give you all a chance to get back in. And then we'll just restart where we left off on this batch. Right. Get on with the action. I've had enough of this waiting around. I want to get it on. So bear with me one second, guys. We'll go back into the stream. One, two, three. Ta da! We're well, back for what seems like the umpteenth time right now. Four but now. Let's, let's give it another now. Four resets of the night. We're doing well. Not. Yeah. So away we go. Just carry it on from where we left off. We will continue regardless. We just Christine's hope that he's laying come properly into his chan now, we can see. Chan, oh, dodges out the way of that low blow, stomach blow though. Takes him to the neck lock. Oh, and the arm ringer. Oof. Hey, where's Adem? Oh, yeah, that tight over there, the hip toss takedown. Once again, we appreciate your patience, guys. We never do it to you willingly, you know. We like you to have a smooth ride here at SDP. Oh, oh there she goes, Chan. Smooth Not ride. Not about what's she doing? Chan. Really, she's standing her up, Chan. Oh, oh no, she decides against it. Wow, some, some, some rolls under the ropes instead. Came across Goes the for a low then. kick. Thank you, Doug. Thank you, Doug. I don't know why it's doing that. Pretty annoying. Oh, look at that spin around. You're a naggy. Oh, what a move from TNT Rose. Wow. She has been trained by some of the best backstage. Even Alexia Sander showing her a couple of pointers. Yeah, she this was... girl, I mean, she was a good fighter before she joined the SDP, but she's had some Oh, and there it is again. Oh, this hatch suplex. Just such a nasty suplex. And I mean, with a solid hard Works wall on the arm her. as well as the back of the neck. Oh, that lady's back chiropractor is going to be needed for shower. For shower. Oh, oh and what I mean, chance I'm to have some iron in a diet. What once count are we even up to? I imagine we're at five by now, I think. Maybe we'll find out. Irish whips are in. Eight Ooh. count. Ooh, that was close, <laughs> ladies. Christine uses the ropes to get up. Chan throws a punch, hits her in the bread basket. Oh. Irish whips her again off the rope, steps back. Moon stomp down and with those elbows. Christine kicks out. Wow, what a counter! Oh, the Chan catches the leg. Dragons, room. Back and forth, these ladies go between one another, matching each other seemingly right now. Stamps down on the leg, stamps down on their arms. Oh, no. Oh, stomps the arms. The bread hooks under assault from Chan. She's Chan not a happy lady. Up, but Christine kicks her away once more. Chan wisely flops out the ring. That's Chan's into the crowd there whilst Chan's outside. Christine, quick jab, quick jab. Oh, kick to the stomach. Oh, we go see. Oh, and play on the floor, here, play. There's a two. Off and into the double arm DDT implant. Wow, Bruce wow. Is I never thought Bruce could teach anyone anything, but he's clearly done something there, hasn't he? Keep that move up well, hasn't she? She has, and it's a good one. Oh, TNT DDT. Ooh, Ten ooh. pinks to Chan, and down she goes. Is that enough? Ready for the pin. One. One. Two. Oh, no. Kicks out at the two. Just kicks out there. That was close. Wow. <laughs> Christine now picks her up. What she's setting her up for. Takes her down. Oh, rolls her over. There it is. The knee strike. Oh, <laughs> it's over, surely. One, two, three. Wow. And I 
I can honestly say I didn't expect Christine Rose to be winning that quickly, especially against Chan, but it is what it is. Let's get some GGs in the chat, please, Cats and Sacks. The ladies threw down hard. Oh, wait. Oh, oh wait. Oh, oh wait. Better respect there, maybe. Chan gonna shake. He does. So, Christine, after the loss with her teammate, picks up the win against Chan of all people? Yeah, against Chan of all well, people? Good match. Good, great goddamn match. GG, ladies, again, not failing to entertain me. And some sportsmanship at the end, gotta respect that. We do like a little bit of turn, a little bit of bitching, but there's nothing wrong with some sportsmanship. No. Oh, yeah. Not at all, especially when you've had a good fight like that. Those ladies went they ham. They didn't do go ham on that one. That so, good old match. Oh, speaking of going ham, well, coming up next in an extreme rules good match, match, which shark is week. basically the only way we can put it in, it is a Shark Week match. We were a little bit upset with just the first two Swampy Syndicate wrestlings. And so far on Dog After Dark, they have been filling that vacuum. There have been a couple of buckets filled. This match is going to guarantee us that it is a Shark Week match. And it is going to be between everything furry and mechanical of mankind. It is Lord Nibbletron, a.k.a. Dirty Little Hamster, going up against Johnny B. Good of the Scum Army. That's right, Cats and Sacks. It is going to be another member of the Mega Nation who won tonight going up against the Scum Army. Can Dirty Little Hamster pick one up? Well, pick another one up, should I say, for the Mega Nation. It would look good for them. It really, really would. But, I mean, look at this imposing fiend on the right-hand side. This man has had more fights than you've had hot dinners. He would sooner beat you up than, you know, <laughs> step over you if you were in his way. Let's see what kind of action he brings against Dirty Little Hamster because that man will fight tooth and claw like you would expect any furry rodent to. <sighs> but I've seen Johnny be good, man. You've seen his brother, his brother who survived a motorcycle accident that would have killed. They both bleed at the same time. You know what, mate? Given everything we've seen... Here on SDP. <laughs> we haven't so had a draw on Shark Week match. We have yet. never had a draw, but I would think... We've had a few draws, but not on a Shark Week match. It, anything's possible. Absolutely anything. I would not be surprised. I mean, remember it was you who said... Oh, I've never seen a Blackout. I've never seen Blackout. I don't know why I bothered giving it to them. And then literally, for like a week running, it, all it was, you pulled one off, Nine pulled one off. You know, I've seen someone else pull yeah. one off. Spitebot listens. You should know this by now. <laughs> it listens intently. It watches you while you pee. <laughs> <laughs> you let me say this shit. That's all oh I'm going to say. Shit In, anyway, right? <laughs> right, anyway. It is going it is to be fine. Lord Nibbletron versus Johnny B. Good next here in a Shark Week match on Dog After Dark. Let's goddamn do this. Let me when it comes to these cars. You know me, I don't need no introduction. Drive business around the city, I'm buttons. All making real things. Hold on, bro. I'm just putting it a bit. Hold on, mate. And tomorrow I'm looking after Dante here, so uh, might very well uh, place your black out with your mate. You're up for it. Anyway, making his way to the ring. Yeah, I, yeah, I know you're excited though, aren't you? You wanted to see it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God, one of them's enough, just like one of you's enough. Anyway, representing the Mega Nation, coming out to the ring now, it is Dirty Little Hamster, aka Lord Nibble Drop, like the future ruler of every single here on Earth. And while he's got to be feeling confident, he watched Fix and pull off an absolutely amazing match earlier on tonight. I know the win for the Mega Nation would only be a good thing to watch. Of course it could, of course it could. Uh, his opponent you can bet tonight will be looking for some sort of uh, 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 uh singles matches maybe. Um 
that would be a blackout <laughs> so yeah, we have we'd have three guys that couldn't drive cars snipe very well normally or stick with a team for too long well, don't stick with a team and just go off and do their own thing yeah if he gets he's with a team like you said at the time like dude where are you and he turns around and just let the house with the loop like 50 miles away oh yeah i was just going out you know hunting you know sort of thing so, so we're going to park out here in three directions god how could we lose <laughs> so we're going to park here which means we're going to land here guys okay seven 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 where are you oh over by the dam seven we're on the other side of the map Right, all came down here. You um, marked the area we were landing. Yeah. <laughs> Raptors can't read maps. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I mean, that is dirty little answer is in the ring. You know it, Lord Nibbletron. A city all good enough to lie. It's a poser. Coming down to the ring is the original version of the tune. Oh, well, no, I don't think you would. You see, this is the problem with Spotify. This is yeah. Anyway, looking ominous and big as a fuck. Anyway, representing the Scum Army, it is Johnny. Be good. Play the guitar like you were ringing a bell. Go, go. Go, Johnny, go. This man really ain't about singing so much as smashing skulls as you can see. Look at the stars. This man had knife fights just for people looking at him funny. Well, you know that game when you used to go out and play like dodgeball? He used to play with bricks and dads. Yeah, you know, good old pumpkin. Yeah, good old council estate yeah. kids, yeah. You know, we didn't need uh, no, uh, <laughs> no soft little bouncy balls and stuff. I mean, I hear even the, uh, even the football's like classic side. I mean, even bricks don't go down, so you're good then. You, know, you don't have to keep reinflating them. Absolutely. So, Johnny be good. About to spit his typhoid on everybody now. Johnny be good. Big, mean, nasty. He is an absolute tank of a man. This bloke spent a lot of time in the gym when he was uh, being entertained by Her Majesty's pleasure. I was going to say, probably a lot of time in prison, I would have thought. Yes, indeed. We used to call it murder ball. <laughs> <laughs> murder ball. Yeah, more kids lost more teeth to that than I can count, Joe. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> and he wouldn't just one string playing or one group of friends in the whole room and sat in the whole room. It's Charles Ball played that game. Oh, yeah. Oh, Whatever we used to call Rochambeau back in the day. Oh, I, know, I always go first in that game. I don't care what you want to say. I thought it was preferable to go near the end because everyone would have been tired by it. Box, <laughs> <laughs> no, I am delivering the first game. Nah. <laughs> then I have to get the bus. <laughs> That's the one. There he is. Johnny B. Good, he's ready. Let's not rule this out, though. We have seen this man beat by not only smaller competitors, but competitors we wouldn't have even thought would have stood a chance against him. Gotcha, yeah, gotcha. Yeah. I mean, he's going up against Lord Nibbletron, a seasoned veteran, a member of the Mega Nation. Ring the bell, let's see what happens. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh. <laughs> Johnny B. Good Oh, boom. He's not wasting time. He's Johnny B. Good Snake, I don't give a fuck. And another one. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, I think Lord Nibbleton was going to be eating for a straw later on. Johnny oh, thinks he's obviously Lord. in 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 the, in the in the dog and trumpet possibly. You know, oh, like, Jack is the one's pushing. Oh, the brain power! Wow, brain power, Calvin. <coughs> I mean, so far Lord Nibbleton not having a great time against Johnny B. Good. Nibbleton counters like. Oh, there's that speed, that finesse, that veterancy of Lord Nibbleton puts him up in the corner. Woo! Johnny B. Good though catches the leg, drags him down. Uh oh. Oh. And that calf kick, man. I mean, all of these blows are literally rocking Dirty Little Hamster to his core. He's having to fight hard to shake off the cobwebs. Oof, misses with that roll into that kick. That would have been, that would have been over, I'm sure. That, that, would, that, would, that would have been an execution, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, the kicks start raining in from the hamster. And given those kicks, you can tell he knew that kick would have finished him off. He's not indeed, happy. Indeed. Oh, then he rains down those multiple punches and slams his head into the mat. Dirty Little Hamster showing he can be just as good as kicking the ring while he's down. Goes round. Oh, misses with a savat kick once again. Again, lucky that didn't connect. That would have beheaded but the Dirty Little Hamster. So Wait a man minute. that large shouldn't be doing kicks like that. Oh, oh Nathan Jones did. Yeah, I know. 
That was bad enough. Yeah, people don't remember him either. People don't remember Nathan Jones. No. Has it been that long since I've watched wrestling? Yeah, people I don't remember Nathan Australia Jones. Yeah, right? Yeah, he was mean. He had a future. I don't know what the f He injured himself badly, really. Ooh! Ooh, one of the kicks finally connects. Ooh! So much connect. And then a punch. One with wow. The Dirty getting rocked and it comes back. Now remember guys, this isn't pinfall submission, this oh, is a sharp match. Ranger. Rolls him into a yes, the Russian leg sweep. Have some caviar with those biscuits. Oh, yeah, me arc. And I remember guys, this is a sharp weak match. First to bleed, and these guys have already taken some pretty big blows to the noggin. Oh, what a defeat! Wow, that could have done it right there. And the I mean, man you'd have thought him wise with his fists is definitely sending those kicks a lot more than what I thought he would have done. He wants this over with. He's gonna oh, lays him out of that head but once again. And again, you see, just a move like that could do it by now. He's had a punch. couple already. Yeah, oh, misses with that one. Dirty kicks back, puts him once again into the corner. Ooh. Oh, cows alive from the big man. Throws him in. Sets him up, what is he going to do? Uh -oh. oh my dear lord. Oh, oh the explainer into the corner! Woo! Oh, wow! Damn. That was every bit as finished. Oh, oh no. Wait, Look no. at this move. The Yunagi Cutter just deadlifts him up. The strength of this guy. It's insane. Irish Rip now hard into the ropes. When you're in uh, solitary confinement, all you can really do is work on your brute strength, isn't it? Indeed. Oh, Dirty picks him up. We're oh, going to see the domination. Hamster, hamster domination. domination. Down goes the, uh, the Johnny. Johnny be good. He was dropped by that. that. Slaps to the face. Wow, and that is a huge insult to Johnny B. Good. He's got a punch for it most likely. But remember, this is a shark week match, guys. Anything can happen anytime anyone can bleed. But even a counter at this point can make these guys bleed. Johnny V. Good catches him, tries to send him over the barricade, but he manages to skim over it like a stone on a pond. Oh, we go over the double arm DDT. A Shark Week! The Shark Week match is over. Dirty Little Hamster is the first. Wow. Johnny V. Good utilising his brute strength and the sheer hard concrete floor beneath that thin pad to get the job done. And my sweet dick, what a goddamn battle that was! Oh, fuck you, Fredman, and bury me alive. Right. <laughs> and for the first time in a while. <laughs> oh, Fredman's been worried. Right, yeah, you've got it, mate. So, I think in his first win in quite a while, well, so like a nice one. It is Johnny B. Curse. Oh, wow. What a time. What a machine. Oof. He's off to the pub to sing a couple of carlings and sing about his victory out there. Yeah, surely that white beer on. I was just there for that. Yeah. It's got to be a seller with that white beer on, sorry. Stellar's a little pricey these days, though. Carlings, you know. No, he's definitely Stellar. Cheap canal swim. Uh, no, 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 I don't think that's good. I don't think that's good. I don't want to sing three carlings, but it's Stellar. <laughs> but anyway, well, that was the last match of the show. Absolutely, let's see. There's been a couple of quick ones. That's, that's been good, though, because we've got it. I hope not. Yeah, it's much of what matters. Yes. So, we have a butcher's block coming up next. A fatal four way butcher's block. Escape only. Escape only. So, from left to right, there you have the king of cruiserweights. It is. T Monster. To the right of him, you have your current reigning Zero G champion, our version of the Cruiserweight champion. It is Axar. To the right of him, is a tag team name we don't know yet. I can't remember what's something. Yeah. And to the right of him, uh, oh, God, I've made it so far. Bradley Bradley, that's the one. Our resident Newcastle fan, straight from the pub, ready to have a bit of a ruckus, you know. I mean, Escape only, guys. So, no pinfall, no submission. Yet to see anyone go out the cage door. I have heard pray from other people on feds. They've seen it happen. I myself have not. But then again, in the last dying months of this game, after nearly a year, I've seen more that was meant to be on offer from the start than I ever have. It's true, it's true, it's true. So, I don't know if I can really bring myself to applaud 2K for finally putting stuff in that should have worked. Well, they've been time. in there the whole time. It's just we've been taking around with the uh, getting it sorted out for... 
They need to, they flow. Need, they need to really communicate with us that, like, you know, like, advertise and, you know, show the power of their game, or well, just the borks of their game, I suppose. Well, trust me, we've got many of their borks on board. <laughs> and they have now been saved to the YouTube. Yes. Oh, speaking of which, I should put that up now. Yes. Uh, the GM has gone to the... Uh... Oh. Yes, it's there. Has gone to the effort now of setting up the YouTube channel so all of the VODs, because some of those VODs, 14 days was not enough to appreciate them. No. There has been so much stuff from when we started we wished we could have saved. Personally, I wish I could have saved when I dropped the, uh, have you heard of the Gestapo? Joke? Yeah. Because Swampy uh, nearly died. I, I made, I made, I, I, Swampy uh, nearly died on uh, cam and Swampy, and Swampy, yeah, Swampy nearly died and Swampy oh. nearly shat his pants because he didn't. Yeah, that was one of the funniest fucking things I've ever heard in my life that whole time. <laughs> 20, 20 years and I've been, been dropping jokes. You've been that one up, haven't you? I had been, I had been working for that like, <laughs> this time. Oh, there it is. Oh, again, I wish we'd kept that one. That was that was awesome. You know, that was my megalomania moment. Sam, I made an ultimate funny. Yes, you did. I mean, I'm sure there were plenty of uh, Germans that would have been offended if they. Well, they would have been right. so, Meh, meh. This is a syndicate bollocks to you. It is. So as the red bar of doom creeps its way along, we are happy to say at this point, thank you for everyone that's joined us, and we're happy with the progress of SDP despite the fact. Mixer has completely made us look so unprofessional tonight. We appreciate all of you for putting up with it and being patient and sticking with us. It obviously means that you're enjoying what we're doing. Or, oh, that, or, you just or you've got some of the sort of ulterior motive or nothing better to so do. So that or you're just farming for sparks and you've actually got us maybe, on mute and you're watching something else. Maybe you've so, gone out and left your uh, your dog in the house and uh, my my voice is soothing him. I don't know. It's, it's, it's plausible. It's plausible indeed. Anyway, the Red Bar of Doom has reached its destination. So what say we get this underway? Fatal four-way, steel cage match, butcher's block, escape only, coming up next on Dog After Dark. All I know is, it ain't Tom Jones. But it is the Welsh anthem. It is the Welsh anthem. And this is anthem. the King of Wales self-confessed. It is the King of the Kiss My Ass Club. The progenitor of the Welsh taco. It is Axon, your zero G champion. Look at that belt. He looks good, that belt. Well, I'm very surprised I haven't had belts sooner. I mean, he's, for all that he is, he took his mask off to drop the one pound so he could go for his weight. Just, that's all it took. Just yep. to get rid of the mask, lose that one pound, and become a cruiserweight champion. Yeah. But I'm just very surprised it took him to do all of that to become a champion. Well, we had him go with Rick Woodson, he didn't do too well. No, but you see, this is it. Even with his dirty tactics, the man's a solid fighter. Yeah. I mean, that bang around, and that, I mean, he's king of DDTs. Mm -hmm. He's got some awesome DDTs. That man takes TDTs to a new level of pedigree, that's for sure. Regardless, it is what it is. Now he's the Zero G champion, and he's still the Zero G champion for now, because obviously it's not a title match. Nope. But, I mean, if you are a champ, that's the reason you've got that belt. Let's see why you've got that belt. Where you just look at. Alright, and relative fresh meat to the SDP. It Come. is Raph St. James. Raph St. James. Another nice, well put together core. Very well. Pizza. It is tea. Monster. Monster. 
And again, we wait for the longest time to get this core in here. We didn't just want to take the liberties. We didn't review others and fall with each other. This one we didn't want to. And we asked and he graciously said yes. As did his partner in crime, Isabella Bros. And we are happy to have him here on our TV. We are indeed in both cores are doing well. Monster isn't a bad move tonight. Oh, someone's obviously shown this like. Right, someone has to be this thing all played this morning. But I mean, that's only a good thing. That means Monster's going to deliver. Now, this man, no, he's had a match with this So, surely, he must feel pretty at home in case. Not all men in this match should be up for a cage match. We've seen them all do it before. That was my hypothesis. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Monster definitely is one of the ones that we've got to watch out for. This man is every bit as crafty as he is a hard hitter. Ah, and that's right. In from Newcastle, it is Bradley. I don't remember this one actually. Yeah, it's for some to start. Quite a few seconds. That's right. This man, uh, well, diehard fan of the old Newcastle. He hates the Mackerels. He is one of these diehard football fans. Yes, football, not soccer. Yes. Uh, Tsunami? Tsunami, indeed. Tsunami! They're so hard up in Newcastle. But when they get into the stadium, the first thing they do is start taking off their clothes. It doesn't matter what temperature it is. Right. I mean, even though water's harder up there. God damn it. <laughs> oh, what a night out. Right. So, the butcher's block has been lowered. Remember, guys, it's... Oh, a Monster takes that axe straight away. Wolf, Monster wastes no damn time. I was trying to tell you guys that this is escape only. That is our patented butcher block. Out the door, over oh, the top. Oh, out there. Wolf's just like... Wow, Monster's going to town for up on axe up. Raph goes in for Brad. Brad, though, counting that punch, uh, that kick. And Raph counting that punch. Monsters going to absolute town on Haxar. Oh. I don't know how many times I can say it, but Haxar was not expecting that from Monster, I don't think. No, and these two always seem to be second guessing one another when they fight. Bradley on the other side gets oh, that knee in. Monster again! Where's the wolf again? Thank you for that, uh, host. Appreciate it, mate. Oh, Monster's gonna give it a try, but uh, that was the no. worst timing in the world. No, Raf says no. Drags it back down. Oh, Hat picks uh, Lee up. Lee delivers a DDT. Wow, the king of DDTs gets a slobber knocker of a DDT himself oh, Bradley. Nice woo! 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 Back elbow strike. Oh, the Sumaki! Man, if he kicks it like that, why ain't he going for Newcastle <laughs> United? Eh? Obviously, been told by old Shearer himself. Oh, that with a good buster. Yeah, and I mean, it's going full whack so far. Every oh, single time. Same change with the lovely K2. <laughs> Mix things up now. Ralph is going up against uh, Monster. Yeah, Hank is going up, up against Bradley. Oh, God, a Welshman and a, and a new kind of Toon Army. I mean, oh, that, well, Monster with that lovely version. And they again. switch back. <laughs> Damn, and these two. Whoa. Well, four guys flowing between one another quite nicely. Oh, 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 oh the legs are up there. Dancing away, Bradley. Goes up whilst, hacks, uh, whilst Monster's dealing with these lovely death stable kicks to Raph. I don't know, man. He don't move like a guy in the doll. Just saying. <laughs> he <laughs> gives Newcastle. it a try. Oh. Not enough Newcastle Brown. Not enough Newcastle Brown for sure. And Hack will punish him. Oh, he drops it. it down. Back to her now, he wants to try and get her out. And Monster just says, Danzel, what, what, what are you doing, mate? I mean, I'm standing right here. Even Raph St. James thinks, no. <laughs> Raph St. James changes his mind. And now it looks like we're going to have a race. Against Monster as we're well. We're going to have a race. Can one of these guys get over before anyone else? This is the thing with the Butcher's Block match. Oh, that's all great. Taken out by Monster. Bradley manages Bradley to realise. He starts climbing. Is he going to be able to get there in time? He can. He's up. But can he pull him back oh, over? He throws the punch. Down. Oh, Raph, I did expect him to get up there quickly. Throws another punch. Raph is managing to get out. Oh, the rollings of that from Monster on Axa. Oh, and now Monster's giving it a go. Oh, this Raph is pulled Raph back in. No way. No way, unless Hack can get back to his feet and get oh. over there. This is going to be over quickly. Bradley. No! Reversal! Monster's almost there. Hagsar's noticed him. No starts climbing. Oh my god, we're going to have a race. Oh! oh no. Off the road! 
ropes there. Oh, I'm an elbow drop on Bradley. And Hack giving it large to the monster who's teetering on the edge of that cage. That must be cutting into his junk something fierce. Hack manages to hold on time, pull him back in. Wow, that's two escape so attempts. Two escape attempts and then two failed escape attempts. But now. Monster counts against. Uh, Hags are, hags are collapsed down, Monster and Raph again. Oh, wait. Oh, you, 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 wait. Who's going? I think Raph's going to get there first. Oh, wait. Can Bradley get wow, to his feet? Wow, he's shot there quick, didn't he? Oh, well, again, he's not, he's not a huge general, but he's quite light. Monster's, Monster's up there as well. Oh, my God. Oh, he goes. He goes with the grapple. He manages to stop. Oh, he stops him. Can he get on the wheel? Oh, God. Monster is going to be the winner of this Butcher's Block match. Yep, it's pretty set now. Monster, I said this guy, he uses his brain as well as his fist. He picked his moment perfectly. He managed to fight off the advances of Haxar. Wow. Monster, the king of cruiserweights, the toughest SOB on Mixer, has just won his first Butcher's Block match. That was not a long one, but that was an exciting one. That was a quick one, but that was a great one. It doesn't need to be long, like I say, you just need that tense moment. So give it up for him, Captain Sacks. Your winner of this Butcher's Block match is TV Monster. GG, sir. Wow. Alright, so, Onwards. you know what's going to happen. We are going to go back to that screen of loading this. We're going to give you a pause briefly whilst we reset for the next um, card. Please, guys, go take a couple of minutes. Have a break. Uh, I need one. My throat's really, really yeah, starting to Our throat's starting to get there. We need to put We've the kettle on. One last show of Dog After Dark. One and more show of Dog After Dark, and then that is us done for the night. It has been a long one. Yes, have a Kit Kat, if you will. Test card. <laughs> Like, you haven't seen it enough already? No, oh, they want the test card. My God, I have this picture of intensely wishing that that head was you. That's... <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, my, my there experience. you go. Anyway, so Cats and Sacks, as we always say, and as we said a lot tonight already, go fill the kettle up, go grab a cold beer, go make a sandwich, kiss a loved one, see to yourself in the bathroom. But whatever you do, please come back. No comment, Seven. Please come back. <laughs> Please come back and join us for the final show of Dog After Dark in the next 10 to 15 minutes. Mods, if you are here, appreciate it. Please keep that chat going. I'm going to go put the kettle on. Swamp's going to take a minute to roll the smokes. We then will start building the final match guard. And remember, guys, tonight, no one has challenged for the Reaper Championship. Or the roulette championship tonight, guys. Uh, well, okay, roulette. But no one has challenged for the Reaper tonight, guys. So this will be your chance. Speak up. Do you want a shot at it? You know the rules. Seven is the current reigning. This is why I want to have a pop at seven. You want a shot against yourself, seven? So here we have it. You know, sometimes you can tell that you, you've been living in Ireland too long. You was ass back in the <laughs> Max versus Seven. I don't see that happening. Oh, oh, give oh, Wesley a shot. Oh, give Wesley a shot at the Reaper. Oh, that'll be up to Wesley. Oh. Right, come on. That's well. Do you want to start down? This is probably the last one. Uh, no, I'm not going to work on it. Work off your life. Oh. It's done. Wolf wants it, so we will make it happen. Oh. Oh.
Through the glass, don't know how much time has passed. Oh God, it feels like forever. But no one ever tells you that forever feels like home. Sitting all alone inside your head. Cause I'm looking at you through the glass. Don't know how much time has passed. All I know is that it feels like forever. But no one ever tells you that forever feels like home. Sitting all alone inside your head. Someone needs a little gnome hat. <laughs> <laughs> that is the question. But I forget you don't expect an easy answer. When something like a soul becomes initialized, fold it up like paper dolls and little notes. You can't expect a bit of hope. So while you're outside looking in, describing what you see, remember what you're staring at is me. Cause I'm looking at you through the glass. This is the one in danger. All I know is that it feels like forever. No one ever tells you that forever feels like home. Sitting all alone. How much is real? So much to question. An epidemic of the mannequins contaminating everything. We thought came from the heart, but never did it right from the start. Just listen to the noises. Before you tell yourself it's just a different scene. Thank you for the sparks, Wolfie. Appreciate that, brother.
God, it feels like forever. But no one ever tells you that forever feels like home. Sitting all alone inside your head. Cause I'm looking at you through the glass. Don't know how much time is passed. I got some of the drama. That guy's Just the one. We play ahead, we won't be long, it's a beautiful day to waste away. There's no such thing as just a drink, is there? Yeah, when? I cannot think of one time in drinking for 30 years. I got you. Okay. I cannot remember one occasion I've gone out for a singular drink. It's always turned into it, especially Wednesday nights. The drinks were a pound.
<laughs> yeah, that's true, man. I didn't see that bit there. Really high, actually. Facts, bad man. Absolute facts.
And we're back. Oh, God. We're still here. And obviously, some of you are still here as well. So that must mean you want more wrestling. We're happy to deliver. So, welcome to show number two of Dog After Dark. He still is Swampy Dog. I, apparently, according to law, am still Sandman. So we, we can change that. Until we can change it. And then it's going to be Sandy Pants. Yeah, well, whatever it is. <laughs> I mean, right. So, guys, obviously, you know there's some matches on. We know we've got a title match at the very end of tonight. Oh, yes. Our um, only title match of tonight's stream, and that one's going to end on a boom. Indeed, indeed, indeed. But to start off, we have a normal one on one, mm -hmm. and we have two gentlemen that uh, are both very good fighters, and one of them has started a bit of a phenomenon here mm. on, uh, on SDP. Uh, he is, you know, the sort of leader, the founder, the progenitor of two letters combined into a three-letter word that can be spread over and over again to simplify joy and and acceptance and various all the bollocks are waffling on about. It is still Hunter Wolf and Lord Crimson. Wow. And we're going to show number two? No, I'm just going to go straight on. No, we're just going to go straight on? Excellent. I say let's go on with it. Why the hell not? Yeah, so Dog After Dark, show two, final show of the night tonight. It's been a long one. We have been going almost seven hours, well, about over seven hours now. It feels like it, doesn't it? Yeah. We, we have delivered yeah. shit tons of wrestling in one night because we needed to, and well, because we could. Yeah, why not? Because we could. You guys deserve it. Yeah, you do. You know, sometimes we feel like spoiling you a little bit. Tonight is one of those occasions, although tonight has been a very heavy traffic uh, place on Mixer, as well as a very balky place mm. in Mixer, which has screwed us over several times. Again, those of you that stood by us and continued there, thank you. We have to me, I'm showing on a speaking. Um, there's no point, Wolfie, because we've had to reset the stream three times now. Four times. Four times. There's going to be four VODs for tonight. We started around 6.45, just before 7, something like that, and it's now approaching 1 in the morning, so we've been uh, so we've been going a while. Like I said, we've had two Swampy Syndicates that were meant to be on Monday, which we couldn't do because 2K gave us a Thanos moment. And, well, Tuesday is traditionally dog after dark, so we figured. And as I've got a full week ahead at work, I don't have time to do anyone else mm -hmm. on any other day, so I thought, bang it out tonight, after dinner. I mean, again, you did good work considering what you had to work with, mate. You know, I was lucky it was only the universe that disappeared. If it had started deleting characters again as well, I'd have been screwed. I, was like, I think Thanos literally only got to like snap his, you know, clap his fingers rather than snap them this time, yeah. which was probably quite a good thing. Regardless, it worked out in the end because, well, you didn't have to do it on your own. Imagine how your throat would have felt if you'd done that last night and today. My throat's hurting pretty much as it is. Could have been painful. Mm -hmm. Could have been doing. Right. So the red bar of doom is making its way up along the along its passage, the long passage that it has to get to the very end and tell us we're loaded. <laughs> now, Mr. Hunter Wolf again. Haven't seen him. Great call. A great, great call. call. Absolutely. Uh, it's been a few weeks since we've seen him. Yeah. But last time I remember seeing him, put on, a, put on a pretty valiant effort from what I remember. Uh -huh. And Mr. Crimson, well, Mr. Lord Crimson is Mr. Lord Crimson at the end of the day. He does what he does. He's got a mechanical goddamn arm. Yeah. Yes. Trendsetter as well. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's just a simple 1v1 to start with. Why not? We can always work our way in gradually. Oh, it's painful, I'll tell you that. I'll take your word for it, Wolfie. down to the awesome tunes of the only brummy I'll let off. That's right, I don't even let fish off for it, but the only brummy I will let off in my life. The Lord of Men. Yes, Mr. Ozzy Osbourne. Oh, and Mr. Oh, yeah. it is Hunter Wolf. Lots of wolves. I mean, they're good, noble, majestic pack creatures, as well as lovely things from my ear. We found out they're stronger than bears. I do. Yes, if we may remember. Yes, uh, I too remember Wolfie. I, 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 I trained for a couple of months with the uh, Midland Wrestling League, and yeah. uh, I learned, you know, that a chair shot is a chair shot, and it still hurts. I learned that being, you know, I thought it was a pretty big dude, you know, I was, I was approaching 17 stone, I met a guy there that was 26 stone. And he still flip around and he, he, No, 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 he just wait and he picked me up. <laughs> <laughs> well, you see, I wanted to be the eager student, didn't I? So, 
when Madge went, right, who wants to choke slam off the gentleman? Everyone else went quiet and went, <laughs> I'll do it. And uh, no, uh, it didn't go well. I went in the air and I came down pretty hard. Got you, uh, no. Great man, RKO. Unfortunately, this is a AI versus AI, or in layman's terms, CPU versus CPU universe. We don't play these matches, my friend. So, uh, we should probably warn you now not to waste your breath. If you try and coax us, we're still going to say no. If you call us in the next, we're still going to be no. So. Is it live stream playing up? Oh, it's live stream. Wow. What a surprise. Oh no. Oh no, you built all that shit as well, didn't you? So, we can't do a full length show without this, I'm sorry. No, we can't. Ladies, so... gentlemen, cats, sacks, boys and girls of all ages, please, get to thy feet and join us in the chant of Mr. Fusion Davis and Lord Crimson. For it is the do 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 Don't kill yourself with the do 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 Don't boo the do Keep saying it, one day you will see the new t shirts endorsed by Mr. Future and Dennis himself. Please get to pour it on that and you know it. Chen, <laughs> uh, spamming the Kuchu button at the moment. <laughs> I think he would have. No, I think he would have. Chen would have passed out by now and not. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, Lord Crimson is down. The gentlemen are in the ground, they are in the ring, they are ready to have a go at each other. Crimson full of confidence. As always. Wiggle shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just set them off. I we can work yet. It's spiteful, remember. This is true. Anyway, right. Hans the Wolf runs on over, or walks on over. Forearm strike, forearm strike, and then a kick for the leg. Just hit him with Billy Bats. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, Wolf immediately sends Lord Crimson into that corner all over him like a rabbit. Oh, Lord Crimson now comes back strong. Irish whips him his own into his own corner. Oh. Oh. No, Wolf again blocking him. Again, this is a. Oh. Oh, Crimson, no. Oh, oh sit down, power bomb. And Crimson says, all right, mate, I'll, I'll put you with the power bomb. Why not? Put yourself wow. in that position. That rolls him over. The ref, I mean, that happened wow. so quick. The ref wasn't even ready for it. No way. Forward, surely we're not going to see it again. There's going to be a squash match. I'm going to be shocked. Oh, look at that shot. The push is in the length of the ring. I mean, damn, this is a dude with a biomechanical <coughs> metal arm. I mean, he's got some strength to him. He's basically Sting turned Jacks. into a Terminator. It's Jax. Oh, no. Jack's had two. Well, yeah, but he's only afford half a jump. No, oh, right, okay. <laughs> the wages on that high here on SDP. Oh, look at that lovely head. This is a takedown. Take Brilliant move. Rotation head scissors. Lord. Oof. Ran into the super kick. Did you oh, oh, see him? I mean, he gets straight back up. Oh, into well, it's a wolf again with another counter. Why, it's going to be one of Oh, them. but they're mowed down by Lord Crimson. And he's trying to get a word in, and these guys keep doing cool shit. <laughs> I'm saying it's going to be one of those types of matches by the looks oh, of it, Cancer right. Sacks. We've got heads of wolf counters. Some blows going to the stomach now. Pushing back Crimson. Crimson, he's... Uh, Throws his forearms once again. Crimson ducks underneath. But how he can duck underneath someone that small? Right. Oh, runs him down. Yeah, just, he ducks underneath. And then he does something like that. Just mows him down. And then shoves him back once again. I mean, there's a considerable size, weight and strength difference here. And oh. I'm right now... He oh, wait. Oh, well, Hunter comes back once more. Hunter Wolf being an absolute <coughs> beast there. Another head scissor takedown. We're going to see a lot of duplicated moves for him because of the weight protection. <laughs> Oh, oh no. Crimson comes back once more. Yeah, I've been thinking that, Wolfie. Makes sense, there's a lot of you. Yeah. There's a good group of wolves in this. Oh, the headshot misses. The clothesline doesn't sink. Crimson into the corner. I'm going to say, so far, Crimson, he's getting a fight, isn't he, from Hunter Wolf? Hunter Wolf is not going down easy, is he? He's definitely coming out looking to score the win today. The problem is... And a super oh. kick again! And I mean, again, this is a dude that just tossed him across the ring. One, two, no. Ooh, 
Whoa. Wow. 2.9, 2.9. 2.8, I reckon. 2.83, I'm going to say. He's spoke, I mean, I've, that certainly rocked the world. Oh, no. Oh, the nah. bread hooks. Oh, the bread hook is sold. That certainly shook the world of Lord Crimson. But Lord Crimson kicks away once more. Not impressed with Hunter Wolf, that's for sure. Oh, he picks him up to that shoulder carry. Are oh, we going to see the spine buster? We are. Oh, that's the crimson finisher. That almost ceases to be a spine buster <laughs> when your head hits the ceiling like swamp. I know, Good I know, I know. Cut. And crimson rolls him over now. Goes into the pin. Why not? One, One two. Ooh, Wolf managed to kick out. That's the first time him the Wolf's really been shaken to his core. But bear in mind, he's been bringing the heat to Lord Crimson almost non-stop since that bell rang. And it's it's turn. He's all he's soaked up a lot. Oh, the drives the elbow down. Puts that mechanical arm to good use. Goes almost the pin. stops the heart. One, Hunter Wolf. Two. No. Ooh, Hunter yeah, just he kicks he out. Uh, he, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't believe you remember. We said this last time. Uh, here is two goes one. Ah, yes. Well, no problem, Wolfie. I mean, surely it won't be the last we will see. He won't retire. Nah. You'll see it come up you, on game you pass. Know, I'm going to quickly get it and then remake my core. We know, we know what Hawk's going to do. You'll try and stay away, but we'll be back. Oh, Crimson on the comeback train now, oh, dropping those heavy hands. Nice Although, <coughs> I've got to say, I don't blame you, man. The bullshit we put up with for this game, and I mean, you know. 2K definitely don't make themselves proud. Oh, oh wow! Oh, what a European uppercut! He pops him up! But Wolf comes back with that lovely Urukarana! Oh, standing boots on! Oh, the wow! He's embracing that move! One, no, not even on one count! I have to say, Wolfie, I don't blame you, mate. I mean, you know, how many Thanos moments have we all suffered, you know, trying to hold on to it? I mean, you. The beginning of the season was You're ridiculous. a bit upset at the moment as well, mate. You've just lost all of your Fallout 4 data, which I know, mate, when you spend hours making something... Oh, oh Reason really, just misses that It's just line. gone, mate. It hurts. <coughs> oh, the first three hours I put into my Sanctuary settlement uh, corrupted. Reason stops that rolling elbow. And I didn't save it. I should have done. Three hours worth of work gone. No, Those mean. punches. Three count now. Oh, the shot of the week! Reason is cut open by that calf kick. Wow. Now four. I mean, it's been a bloodbath tonight on Dog After Dark. Certainly making up for the uh, lack of it in... Oh, God. And then Crimson, absolutely. Six count now, though. Absolutely has to get back in the ring. Guys. There's no way around it. What a strike. Lord Crimson, no. Not like this. Phew. Sees a sense of honour, puts him back into the ring, and I mean, I don't know, Wolf is hurting. <coughs> He's hurting hard. You can't. Oh wait, no! Drops the elbow once again. He's going for the pin. <coughs> One, two. Oh, Hunter Wolf just gets his arm up. Wait, I and heard. I heard, I heard. A three. I thought I saw a three. I heard as well. a three. Oh, Rex decision is final. Hunter fights back. And the one inch spear. The one inch spear takes that Lord Crimson. Oh, I'm good, Wolfie. Don't worry, I've just got a frog in my throat. Yeah, uh, he's been talking a lot. He's got hay fever. Nah, he's got into that power bomb. Come on, ref. One, One two, two, three. Hunter Wolf. Oh, Hunter Wolf picks up the win with that power bomb pin. Where if I can find the move? I'm far on now. Uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, Bucket Moon. Uh, I don't know where to put it. Where's the one? Uh, oh, wait. Hunter Wolf. <laughs> oh no! Oh, you won the match, Hunter. What are you doing? Oh, lays in the stomps. Wow, come on, Hunter. I mean, you won decisively, mate. You don't need to kick him while he's down. Oh, salt there, salt. Why can't we all just get along? Regardless, your winner of that match. Give it up for him. He's sat at the back waiting for some action for a couple of weeks. Hunter Wolf, GG, sir. <coughs> I, uh, I wouldn't take that for yes either, mate. No, I'm sure there'll be something coming from that. I'm sure. I knew what you meant, bro. <laughs> Not the grammar Nazi here. I can't spell to save my life either. Wow.
tag team action coming up next. And it's I've been waiting to see these guys. Left, you have the family ties, Keith and Brad Bartlett, the family ties, the Eliminator and the Predator. That's right. Aha, look at me doing my job. And on the right hand side, the Python crew, the Pot Noodle crew, the Metal Suited crew, <coughs> what you will. Ethan Whitehead and David McRoberts. McRoberts. Green and yellow, or orange. Green and orange. Now, both of them chicken flavored. I them. would normally say that most teams going up against the MSC weren't going to stand much of a chance, but family ties. Right, they're a good tag team. Are an absolute fucking they're team. They're an absolute unit of a team. I mean, don't forget that this isn't the original lineup. Family ties was no. originally Keith Bishop. Brothers. And he had to back out because of neck injury. So they brought in their cousin, Brad, and oh my God, even though he's a cruiserweight, my Lord, he has filled that spot. He has just been getting win after win after win with his team lately. And not just that, they could perform pretty damn admirably on their own, put them together, they're damn near unstoppable. This is true. So I think it's safe to say MSC, if they're going in here thinking they're going to get the win initially It's not going to be an easy fight for them, I don't think. Now, I know that they'll use any tactic necessary to get the win, but <coughs> I'm fairly confident that... Uh, you know, Keith and uh, Brad aren't just gonna sit there and let them put away with their dirty antics. Yeah, you never know, you never know. We don't know what's going to happen to these guys. I mean, Ethan is well known for his grabbing them and suplexing them over the rope to the outside. Well, this is just a normal tag team, right? Yeah. This is no ta uh, tornado. This is no, a just normal tag. You were absolutely right then. I mean, they will do anything. We've got one, one really big match tonight. And that's going to hurt my throat enough, so I thought the rest of these are going to be nice and calm. Yes, I mean... We've oh, indeed, indeed, Wolfie. What was he thinking about? I mean, the MSC haven't been making friends lately. They've definitely not been making... Uh, definitely in Clayton enemies. So we'll see what happens. Well, I think it's safe to say this is the kind of team they ain't here to make friends or alliances. They're here to get the win under any circumstances. Proper, you know, like Shepherd Renegade mode. <coughs> get anything done by any means necessary to get the job done. And if that means cheating, so be it. I mean... I'm expecting to see it, but I'm also expecting to see Brad and Eddie pull out some hard punches. They work well together. The Red Bar of Doom has done its job. Are we ready, DJ? Well, let's do it then. Oh, here they are. Family ties. And the eliminator. These two guys are awesome together. We picked them up as close as we can about the fight while getting involved. Me, bear in mind, most of these balls that we made were taken to fill gaps in. These guys have survived because they're working together. One of the best tag teams we have. And they did thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, they did. So it's safe to say that you have to keep these guys around a little bit longer. Let's see how it goes out. I told you I'll watch that video about the Techno Bike Man. Yeah. Show it to you, my hero. Yeah, I'll show you the video uh, when we go to school about 10. <coughs> so I've never even heard of the Techno Bike Man. Bear in mind, I wasn't really into meat culture at that time when the first bike became popular. That's right, and glowing, ominous green and ominous yellow, tasting of chicken and mushroom, and a little bit of chicken, perhaps. It, it is. is. David McRoberts and Ethan Whitehead, the metal suited crew. And yet, maybe a couple more of them related. I'm not going to make any assumptions. And I completely agree with you, Wolfie. I mean, you know, I'm all for creativeness. You know, you remember a time I was watching wrestling when Mark Henry and Mate Young Mark Henry's hand. What the fuck is that? So I'm all for wacky gimmicks and shit, mate. But we can all draw the line somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah.
Jack set to climb the joint, isn't there? For sure. I know Wolfie, I know you're like know many others who like protection realism and stuff. But it's what it is, you know. There's plenty of that on display here already, so you know. Let the crayon come in, as it were. For <laughs> all equal opportunities here, we're all friends, you know. Oh, uh, so here we go. Brad Bartlett lines up first. The crew's way up against David McRoberts. Uh, the usual kind of setup here for the MSC. It's David McRoberts coming in. Oh, oh runs through the C5. Doesn't connect properly, but the legs connect. Yeah, it looked like it hurt everyone involved that oh, one. Oh, that Brad, a stiff kick there. Not bad enough. So, again, remember these guys are going to go hammer one in with the. I think they faced each other before? No, not this combo. Not this one. No, they've met up with Andonets and. No, with Callum and one of these. I think it was Ethan. But not David. Well, not that it makes much difference. Not, not really, really. No, no, no. Research, yeah. no, 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 exactly. <coughs> oh, Brad though reverses him, takes his legs out from underneath him. Oh, picks him up. Brad David, just the power. Again, this is a cruiserweight versus a super. Oh, and he goes for the bite. Ugh, yeah, that's the problem, Wolfie, yeah. Unless you're using an aluminium bat. Look at oh, the power. Oh, he just deadlifts him down into the Dominator. Ooh, wow. That looked painful. Brad though ducks underneath. He's got some resiliency, this guy. Amazing. Again, yeah, cruise away, but, but he can't rule him out. Look at Max. Max Irish whipped into the MSC corner and dives out the way instead of taking the spear. Superior strength comes oh, into play there. Oh, he comes over now. Oh, we go. oh, look at this. Lovely. Down it goes. Wow. Great leg drop there. Yeah. Hangs him up across the rope. He ain't sticking around Ethan Whitehead, is he? He knows, no, he's the, he knows the Irish whips it back over to Eddie's side now. Oh, has gone in. Are we going to see the first tag? We are indeed. Eddie now comes into the ring. So first tag maneuver is up. Oh wait! Oh, the backbreaker into the, into the Irish. knee drop. Wow! What's that called Irish? No, it's not the Irish. Uh, that's his backbreaker. Oh damn! That looked every bit as painful as it should Oof. do. And now give him the black guy on the other side now. Man with the most unmanly name I can think of. I have to agree with Eddie. Keith. No, he keeps not in this anymore. That's Eddie. Oh, that's Eddie, right. Sorry, yeah, got Keith confused. Right, got, but but we, we agree Keith is the least manliest name on the planet. Keith's the barbarian. Keith's the destroyer. Keith. Yeah, Keith the barbarian. No. Keith is the most manly of names. It's like Bruce, it's like Bob. It's the most Peruvian of Peruvian names. No, well, Anderson is, but, you know, I mean... <coughs> wow, the ref nearly gets taken out in that one. Oh, one. David laughs at his work. I mean, when you add the word moon to it, Keith sounds good. Yeah. You know, but I can't think of any other. Oh, maybe one. Throws the punch. Oh, there you go. Cancels out. Runs in. Takes the leg out. Forward chop block. David McRoberts down. Probably for the first proper time now. Right. Now, Eddie comes in. Picks him up. Goes in for the. Oh, shred him with the trap squeeze. Evolving. Crossbar. Then he's broken on the ropes. I mean, he now taunts into the crowd. Well, at least taught into Ethan Whitehead as well. He wanted that hot tag. Oh, oh Ethan oh, throws those punches. I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> and he's not going to be happy, but he stays focused. He stays, this, yeah, he does need this one. This is what he's going to punches now. Wow. This is what I was just going to say. This is what he's going to Oh, look what's he going to do? No. Into the power bomb. Oh, oh drop down. God damn, that was a jackknife and a half. Almost put him through the goddamn ring then. Jesus. In the back of the leg, deafening in the legs underneath him. D David McRoberts was surely, oh, surely want to go corner. for a pin. Uh, sorry, a tag here soon. He's been in a while. Ah, oh, that high foot choke. No man should physically be able to get his leg like that. Not worth, especially when you're seven foot tall in a metal goddamn suit. Keep the teeth. <laughs> Thank you, my man. Oh, and there's that raw brute strength on display again. Oh, and down into the power bomb. Now, Eddie is uh, like heavyweight. Uh, uh, <laughs> spray on, yeah? Uh, spray. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the tag. First tag made. I wonder if there's a, the towel cut before they put him on. I have no idea. <laughs> but how do they pull off with this? I have no off? idea. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what they get Lexi and Rachel to do for them. All I know is when it comes to squeezing into something, Kate that Beckinsale... That might explain why Anderlitz is so purple. All I know is when it comes to squeezing into something, Kate Beckinsale from the underworld, oh. it took her... Or well, seven of nine. Yeah, uh, it took her, what, an hour and a half to squeeze into that cat suit? I don't think I'm happy to watch it. It took me ten seconds to peel her out with my teeth. Yeah, that's fair, fair, Right? Fair. But <laughs> worth the effort. And he now starts working on... Oh, Ethan slams his face into the floor. Ooh. 
Action is still continuing, isn't it? Well, that like one's come. I'm really have lost the power of English. Well, we have been talking a lot for a long time, and this is what happened the last Ooh, time. Oh, the kick to the gut there. That was a bit mean. Drags him back into the corner. No, away from the grim. And Eddie Ooh, he's just... Oh, oh no. Not another one, surely. How many... Oh, a pile driver. Look at Eddie's just face. Just crumbles. Good job, he didn't have his tongue out. And then he crazy. goes in for the munch. Wow. David, you're a crap green window, brother. That's all I'm going to tell you now. Oh, that spits out. Oh, good. the blood that was in his mouth. from am to Oh, he just that. lost a finger into the crowd. Wow, and he comes back though, the arm ringer takes him to the floor, ah. starts laying in those heavy punches, oh, dropping them in, and then stomps down the gut. Bad good job, I know what moves are going on, maybe that window's in the way, right? Eddie now, oh, that kick just shoves Ethan to the floor. Goes for the pig, Goes ref. The pig quick, ref's this thing, rubbish. Another one to be shot to the sun by the looks of it. Wake the fuck up, brother. Picks him up. Oof, oh. kick to the gut. Irish whips him into his own corner. Oh. Now we're going to see the family connection. I do believe we are. Oh, this is going to be Family connection, power slam! And again, this is a six foot <coughs> sub with a 200 pound dude. Oh, David's in just in time. Oh, the face buster bulldog from Eddie. This is Teaches David a lesson. This is what I was talking about, oh, the guys. Knee for a knee to the face there. The metal suited crew. Oh, Ethan comes back with the eye gouge. I have it to work. Oh, no, not another one, surely, seriously. Surely. Oh, he takes him up. The power bomb spikes him down. Just flops. Just flops and goes very limp and still. Can't blame him. <coughs> Drop and a half. Calves, hamstrings, everything being targeted now. But like Brad fights it back. No, he gets yet another eye gouge. Oh, the card might look painful. Oh, and then for the chomp once more. Has this man not had enough meat today? No, fingers are obviously on the menu for sure. I mean, look, you could see there, Eddie could reach it, he could punch him. But the Brad comes back with a hip toss. Oh, he runs across. What are we going to see? Oh, the horror driver. Oh, what a move. Spikes Ethan down the Davis only just got up to his feet. Oh, oh what's Brad setting up for now? Is he going to run? Oh, they believe it's the running blockbuster. There it is, running blockbuster. Out the corner. Wow. Brad goes Savage to the pin quickly. Brad, one, two, two. Ooh. Three was on the tip of the tongue, but. but oh, no. He Ethan turns White around. Says no. Irish whips him into the corner. Runs in. Oh dear lord. No, 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 Brad. no, 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 Brad, no, 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 he's been a good boy and he's staying up. It doesn't oh, matter anyway. Straight back into the ring, though. I think Ethan might need to take himself a nice little uh, break on the side of the road. Oh, wait. Oh, but Ethan, he goes Got in. And went, oh, no, pilot driver. Oh, my lord. That's going to be about three and a half inches shorter by the time this is. Seriously? He's just demolishing him. Oh, yeah, another spike power bomb. All right, I don't know what's more impressive the fact that this man has pulled off that many moves, or the fact that that man is still alive after receiving all of those moves. I'm more impressed with <laughs> it. Oh, the fall of man. Oh, Christ, someone's going to fall for sure, and I don't think it's going to be any of these two bright bastards. Oh, oh smash down. David goes in for the pit. Eddie's there though, he sees it, and he breaks it up early. That's another good moment from a teammate there, covering his back. Ooh! David McRoberts. <coughs> That's a bit annoying. That was a very bit... Oh, oh no. Oh, killer. Here it comes, Officer down, and that has surely got to be the end for Brad Bartlett. No one in his corner's coming to save him this time. He's got to kick out on his own, or this is over, and it looks like... One, one two... two Oh, wow! You have got to be shitting me. What's the nasty of this little man? He comes round from behind. Oh, we're going to go for the, the bulldog. Bulldog! Oh, he drops him down like yesterday's toilet roll into the bathroom. Joke. Rolls him round. Hell's Gate to the house. Hell's Gate locked in. 
Adam the Bulldog or David Tapp, surely. Don't know. No, no, David fights out. No! He tapped! Surely that was a tap! Yes! Tap! How many times win? Just, this is what I was telling you about. Oh, damn! Brought out the family the ties. Imagination. Oh! The absolute soul Brad took to get that win. It's no, Malcolm <laughs> Classic. <laughs> I don't know if that was great timing or terrible timing or something in between, but do I mean? I mean, they absolutely tried to kill Brad Barber oh, and he just would not die. Brad fought the heart of life there. How much damage? This is powerbomb after powerbomb. Pile driver after pile driver. This is the highlight. And they're all MSC. And they're all MSC highlights. And yet he's supposed to fight back. Get in the hell gate for mission. That's all the victory out of the proverbial bag. I just, I mean, I, 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 I just, 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 I this team gels so bloody well. So give it up for him. Eddie and Brad, the Bartlett's, a.k.a. Family Ties. GG. Wow. Just wow. <laughs> uh, I'm surprised those guys haven't got the tag type. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Holy <laughs> Now, obviously, the ladies couldn't hold back after earlier exchanges. Oh. Are you going to go at it in backstage? Wow. These ladies not going to wait for the goddamn ring. Not going to wait for a bell. We're just going to go and get a camera there. We're going to keep a distance and see how this one plays out. It is going to be Trinity versus Little Tiny Chan. Chan! Or a backstage brawl. And I'm not sure if the GM is in his office, but my God. Hell, no. I hope not. If one of ready with his shot if cans. one of these ladies ends up bent over the GM's desk I might have to leave <laughs> I might have to leave for the sake of everybody that I, I walk out the room and and yeah <coughs> nearly killed the GM there you know what uh, I mean though. don't like going drown on coffee do yes you? the bootified Chan I'm liking the bootified Chan you see you know I mean there's nothing wrong with small ladies but well, you know, if you're going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Sandman, you need to have a little bit of girth. That's for sure. You stand a better chance. Anyway, I hear the cameras are now approaching the backstage. They are standing back. I would certainly tell. Okay. You need to guru. Sure, he's, he's gone through four flashlights in the last three months. <laughs> How do you avoid a warranty in a lifetime? Uh, what is going to stand up. <laughs> Oh, takes that Trinity like knee trembler. Wow, look right away, laying in the blows, and then steps on the back of her head. Look at the and another one. Who? Oh, thank you, Wrenchy goes on. Oh, God, what a hiccup. Bastard. That coffee's meant to be hiccup. So, what you mean, classic is, is that you go up and ask for a name, blow your... Firework, man. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, anyway, Chan there uh, taking a bit of a blow. Trinity's back to her feet. Chan, however, throws Trinity into those uh, boxes. To be fair, Seb, yeah, it is done. To be fair, Seb, it's been so long since you've done it, you probably like might have to consult the manual. Oh, again. <laughs> it's lost Trinity into those barriers again. Uh oh. Trinity though like, reverses, turns Chan around, and the suplex! Woof. Down onto the outside ring, the outside of the area there. Now, that's solid concrete. No, I've done it recently. Uh, oh, Irish whip. Uh, 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 a melon eating a blue microwave off from the whole cut in it doesn't count, mate. Like, <laughs> no, he had his friend come over, didn't he? Did he? Yeah, he had that one come back. Yeah. See, I remember that chap. I remember no chap like that. Yeah. yeah. Sounds like a jolly Trinity, though. Bro, chance through into the danger room. Uh, now I know there's no members of the SDP crew in the changing room right now, so it's all good. Alright, well, let's see what Chana. happens here. Oh, ditches are back! Wow! Sometimes. sometimes. I even remember for people in matches sometimes. 
the Pamela Hanson and her five sisters. Yes, Pamela Handerson. Or, like, probably borrow Buddy Jones' flashlight. Oh, an Irish rips into the... the no, uh, Chan, no. She does oh. Irish rip Trinity into the locker there. Wow, Trinity rebounds off. <laughs> oh, they kick to the top of Trinity's head. Chan. Suplex. Well, that's not Seven touching himself tonight. That's... <laughs> <laughs> Chad and Trinity reverses. Runs in. Oh, 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 God, I thought she was going through that table then, but I mean, <coughs> well, we've got into the changing rooms. There's just a little layer of carpet there. And then the ten pegs are down. It's probably going to hurt more because of the carpet burns than the solid metal stone outside. Yeah, that's outside. a horrible grip carpet. Oh, yeah. It? Irish whips her again into the nothingness. Chan reverses it and does the same back, and throws it to the doorway. Wow. Uh, okay, well, oh, yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. this pool table slightly oh. unhinged. Oh, the Trinity throws her out now. Back into the corridor we go. Right, who the hell is that Trinity up there? setting her up. Uh, I don't know. It's all in purple. Oh, oh she takes her. She's coming better! Ooh, the Trinity wins. Ooh, Trinity gets that super ten peg on the outside and knocks Chan the fuck out. Jesus Christ. Wow, well, Chan is not going to be pleased when she wakes up. Probably not. And who the hell is going to have the balls to go and wake her up? I mean, I mean. You're just going to let her wake up naturally, right? Yeah, I'm going to leave that one for you. All right. right uh, uh, backstage crew, yeah, if you find an unconscious lady, I know it looks a bit suspect, but it wouldn't be wise to disturb her. Let her wake up naturally. Yep, yep, yep. Received over. Thank you. That's awesome. <laughs> Wonderful. Right, just so. Just a blanket over and After the yeah. girl's got it on, like I said, this, this dude's going to keep on brewing for some time now. Right, it's going to get pretty damn hairy. There's going to be scratching, there's going to be biting, there's going to be hair pulling. And that's just from us sitting here commentating. <laughs> you know, let alone what the ladies are going to do to each other. Wow. Well, <coughs> we'll, leave, uh, we'll leave the backstage crew to clean up the blood and, uh, and the rest. regrets on the outside, and we shall continue onwards with the rest of Dog After Dark. And oh, oh, Swamp, I didn't see you set this up. What, uh, what madness is this you talk of? Ah, I thought I'd put a bit of a Bruce in. Is the Reaper coming out to play, I see? No, not, not the Reaper, he's not the belt one. No, oh, well, the belt's he's, out right he's on. the Reaper. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry, is Mr. Nolan coming out to play? Yes, yes, indeed. All right, so they managed to pry him away from the bar and he will be going up against Jordan Storm. Oh, you've given him his match time. Well. <laughs> you are a beast. Is I this, thought you'd like that one. Is this the one, uh, knockout, first round? Yeah, yeah, proper Extreme Wars match. Everything. Yeah, old school Reaper match. Oh, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So, I mean, we've already got a win as well. Tonight we're going to see him yeah, one more that. time. Why not? I'm happy he's been sat backstage just gathering us. Hardcore, yes. Well, it seems like Bruce has this one. Well... <laughs> What do we say? Classic. If he's twenty five percent mode, more than likely. But it, there's always the chance he could be on his seventy five percent mode. See, he's probably just that little one point two extra over the mark. After his last uh, victory as well, he would have sank a few, and yeah, he probably cool. didn't realise he was going to be coming back out to do yeah. some more wrestling. So, um, is he the twenty five percent now or the seventy five percent now? We're going to see. All I do know is is that Jordan Storm. Recently back from injury, I do believe. It is indeed. Comes back with a new attitude and new costume, and trust me, he's back with a passion. Mm -hmm. He's come back fucking raring. Well, I would imagine this man's limbs he are going to be He came back straight away and won the roulette championship, which got took off him by what's his name. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, by Abyss. Yes, he uh, didn't hold it for long, but it was a Two. valiant win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A valiant win. Now, you can bet this man here, if he manages to beat the Reaper Nolan, that would surely put him in a nice positive position to carry on henceforth. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's a good boost in his um, start. Uh, you see, Classic, yeah. that, is, uh, that is exactly right. Yeah, unfortunately, he took Kyle out because I do have quite a lot of Kyles. We, yeah, we realise we have a lot of Kyles. We have a lot of Walls. We had a lot of Kyles. At one point, we had a lot of... What was the second Bishops. Name? We had a lot of Bishops at one point. So, uh, yeah... Uh, Alexis. Oh, Holy cannoli, boys <laughs> and girls! Max Adam is in the building. Mods, please, do I need to ask? Let's give the man with the most sexual voice only next to Barry White <laughs> a shout out here. Thank you for joining us, mate. I know you've been streaming tonight. I thought you might want to have the rest of the night off, but you're here. And well, we well, boy, Max, you. Thank you for coming along, mate. 
Holy cannoli, Holy indeed. Holy cannoli, thank you, Seven. If you have somehow not heard of this amazing dude that is bringing retro check back, him out, man. go and check him out. One day, I will just expect to see Max Headroom on your cam picture. Mm -hmm. That's all I will see, mate, won't rap, it? Rap, just, rap, just be rap, Max Headroom. No, no, no. I'm going to watch Max Headroom Ooh. again now because of you. You make me feel old, Max, but my God, you, you, you bring up some happy memories. That's not song. <laughs> you oh, don't mess up Bruce's song <laughs> or you will not hear the fucking end of it, brother. Anyway, Cats and Sykes, tonight has been a fucking steamer and a half. We surely have hit the seven hour mark oh, yes. because of a mini uh, yesterday. Somehow the GM managed to pull this show together and we did not want to leave it out. We've done Swampy Syndicate. This is the second show of Dog After Dark. Penultimate match. Penultimate already. Yeah, man, those first three have gone quickly, but we do have a 20 minute read for challenge match next. Week, uh -ha. So. so, guys, if you've still got some left in you, so do we. Are you ready? I am now. I've found the right song. Right. Extreme Wars ruled match coming up next on Dog After Dark. Get comfortable, guys. Expect some. bits of our show means a lot to us thank you guys we appreciate it yeah yeah that was happy stuff <laughs> sound pretty confident about that classic sound pretty confident about that no, the hype that Simmons on on that WNA no, 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 I wouldn't even call it hype it's more sort of he's on a train a prophecy a stop, non stop train at the moment a fucking prophecy finally there he is sporting some Max Asset we have one more match after this do not worry, we have a FIFA Championship belt on the grass. That's right, the FIFA Championship is coming up. Yes, Max. And oh, what a match. Oh. You got Wes. So you, you agreed earlier on. You had Wes, mate. Wes is coming. Yeah, no, she's coming. So, Wes, if you're still around, mate, your time is coming. Oh, you mean on FWEs? Oh, FWEs. Yeah. Oh, FWEs. Oh, I'm oh, sorry, my bad. It's been a long day. Yeah. <laughs> so, yes, Max, uh, we apologise, mate. We started really early tonight because we wanted, to, we wanted to get all the shows out. And we know that, again, you were on and I'm caught recording a little while watched. You had a great stream. Wish I could have stayed longer. Same with Fix, the same with Grey yeah, One. Yeah, 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 but yeah, yeah. Tuesday has always been our night and we're going to stick with it until we can come up with a better schedule. Always catch you back on the VOD, and judging from the views, a lot of you do watch the VODs. Don't forget now, VODs are. Right, I am uploading them as they go off, uh, as we get them off here, so please, please go check it out. That's right, because 14 days sometimes is just not enough to appreciate some of the sheer beauty we see. Not just the actual wrestling, but the borks and everything. Oh, dude, dude, just some of our reactions alone are Yeah, amazing. right. So, there he is, the Reaper Nolan, and he is going up against Jordan Storm. And these two have fought before. Reaper actually took the Reaper belt off 
Jordan Stone's become the double champion. Oh, and he picks him up straight away and lands him down with the kneecap. Oh, my God, how rude. Oh, but hold on, hold on. What's that happening? What? What? What's going on? Who's it coming down here? What? Jesus Who's Christ, he's hit one move. What? Music's going on. One move. What's going on? Who? Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Who is it? Oh, it's Adidas! Why is he a bit? Why is he a bit? Why is he come out of the house, Bruce? What? Why is he come out of the house, Bruce? What? But it makes no difference anyway. It's a no DQ match. <laughs> Adidas, for some unknown reason, comes out and helps Bruce. I, Bruce I, goes in for the pin. I, One, I, two, no. three. <laughs> Seven hours at least into our stream. Uh, I'm, I'm not oh. even going to attempt to try it in. <laughs> that, that is that is just that is oh. just one of those moments where I'm going to. Go, oh. <laughs> Fuck's sake! You see, Iga, this is how much we love you guys. Oh. And ending. Oh, Finally, the stream is currently offline. What? Hey, hey, what are we offline? Are we offline? Oh, is that someone signing in as a Scotty bot? Jones, are you packing in? <laughs> Fucking Cockney Gremlin bastard. As I was saying. <laughs> coming up next to end what has been a marathon tonight, it is going to be the one that probably finishes me and Swampy off. He has been on a roll. Grease Lightning's return has been prominent and almost immediately this man is going for a belt attempt and he is going which would be the Reaper off the man to the right. The leader of the Church of Seven sporting his Scorpion <coughs> attire. It is Seven. I'm not sure how this is going to go. I mean, Seven has been on a roll, but I mean, so has Wes. Now this is going... This is one of these matches where myself and Sandman were actually only talking about what would happen if Wes got hold of this belt, Oof. right? Now, we've seen Wes in action already three times this recently, and every match he has absolutely dominated. Even Bear earlier on, pretty much, he dominated. And there's well. anybody at this moment in time that we think is going to beat Maximus's run. It's going to be Wesley, it's going to be Wesley Wolf. Wolf. He has to defend it nine, nine defense, times. Nine defenses. He needs ten defenses to hold it. Ten defenses. And if you do it, Wes, you will get to name the stipulation 
of the Reaper Claws at the moment. That's of course, you haven't won it yet, this is true. Seven just points out a good point there. I mean, seven, yeah, you yeah. know you might get there. I've got a vague inkling you're Talk not going to. Help me out, low no. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Uh, Oyo, we're going to transfer anything. So so if Wes does phase. get his hands on it, we do think it's going to be amusing. Yes, and the question is, I mean, if he does get it, will he hold it? Will he do it? We're going to have to wait to find out. The Red Bar of Doom has done its job. We are ready yeah. to do this. The final match of Dog After Dark is here. Now, I remember something about this bit. What's that? Yo, yo! <laughs> ah, she has. Yes, so just load it up. Let Jojo do her waffling and then we will get on with the tunage. Look, he ain't fighting to be there. And then WWE 7, that was a different 7 completely. Very like. true. I mean, he's, uh, he's on a roll. I mean, both moment. men in the ring are heavyweights in this one, so we'll see how And potentially going to be a role in GCW as well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Keep watching the space for that one. Once again, I reckon that the great one could do it again, and I'll have everyone talking about what's going on. And the crowd goes absolutely batshit, and they should, because they know whose music this is. This is Johnson & Johnson's favourite poster boy. It is Grease Lightning himself. It is Wesley Wolf. And if you're wondering where Rob Zombie is, because he hasn't got his hat on, he's in conscious out back, he wouldn't give the hat on easily. <laughs> Wes says, I'm taking that. Down he comes, looking mean as fuck. Wes suits it up, boots it up, he knows it's a special match. All 20 minutes, finishes only, Iron Man match. That's right guys, that is how the stipulation currently sits on the Reaper Championship. 20 minutes of an Iron Man match, finishes only. And I mean, both of these really gentlemen... You really know, Rob, I was paying attention to this point time, Yes, mods, bear in mind, we don't have a god mode <coughs> no, uh, no with us, so we're going to do our best. If you don't want to pay attention to what's going on too, please. So we're going to miss a few retired. 102 minutes of this stream alone and reset for the time. I do remember when Bruce beat uh, Wesley Wolf on, um, on, on great ones. I, I, I couldn't, but oh god, sorry, I stopped. Because you know what that music means. It makes Sandman a happy man. Oh. Coming down to the That's the one. <laughs> That's right. We talk all that. I don't want to bring you to the one. We talk all that. Get your MK on indeed. It is the leader of the church of seven. It is the Reaper champion. It is seven. And that's right, his tag team partner and Thunder Boy is the current reigning Syndicate champion. He is the PJ current Edward champion. Took it from Great One in his own challenge. Look at Maxi, Great One now with twice. Not bad, but Maximus, when he gets his eyes on some When he wants gold, he gets the gold. That's the big fan of Max. Say the seven definitely bought him up well. I still say your gold on seven is shinier than on Max. <laughs> it's little, isn't it? And it's only Popper got the better for the suit, yeah? Well, wow. <laughs> look at me. Look at Popper first, the boy can follow. You know? <laughs> I'm leader. <laughs> Schoolboy mentality rules here. <laughs> I'm leader. I'm going to show that seven up to 11. Oh, oh, oh some beautiful oh, smack talk oh, from Grease oh, Lightning. Craven smack talk. Oh, this is what we love here. Once again, that is the prize, the blood behind it. That is what you can expect. I expect to see Shark Weeks. You expect to see it. It is the Reaper champion. And this. Over here, as the GM says, poster boy of Johnson & Johnson's, Mr. Grease Lightning himself, the man that gets about more than the village bike, it is Wesley Wolf. And he looks ready to go. Oh, you looking smart. Yeah, right. You know, well, you've, got to, you've got to wear your best friends when you're going to get gold, mate, haven't you? And speaking of wearing your best friends when you've got gold, the man that finally... This is the end of the of the final show, Costa. This is going to be the long one. This, this is the last match of our final show, my friend. 20 minutes of it, so if you want to stick around, you <coughs> might as well get ready. And seven, though. You know you're okay, nines like that, sir? Very well, then. Let's see if you can survive all 20 minutes indeed. Oh, God. I'm now, this match has had a, 
a history of injuring its uh, its fellow uh, contendees, should we say, the contenders. Well, let's so put it like this. Hopefully no one's going to get too badly. This injured, match isn't. was literally just designed to see how much more you want that belt. It is indeed, Is yeah. it worth the pain? Some Hell people yes. think so. Hell yes. Is it worth the injuries? Again, we'll see. Okay, 20 she minutes. Goes the night. Ring that bell, ding, ding, and immediately... Oh, wow, seven the shorts monster away. Monster? No, sorry. Where's away? Where's... Oh, it's already <laughs> started. <laughs> My brain's going to sleep. Well, seven hours. Boris rips him in. Misses with that uh, mistletoe kick, though. Where's lands that heavy punches? Now oh, remember, it's seven reverses. Now remember, guys, these are big, strong, powerful Where's gentlemen. Where's reverses? Just oh, having a heavy kick. Just having a frame like that burns calories and energy. So, are these guys going to go the full 20 minutes without passing the fuck out? We just don't well, know. They don't have a choice. They've got to go the full well, 20 minutes. It's an Ironman match. So, it's a question of Where's how... Stonks on the guts. Oh, lady, that's a big set of feet that was connected there. But seven rolls him round with that lovely shoulder barge. Now, seven Starting beginning on the to the work, he knows Wesley Wolf well, he knows what he's got to do to get the job, but in turn, Wes knows this gentleman, and he knows seven what the deal up. is. Oh, that lovely leg sweep. So far, these oh, two are. the trap squeeze. Live long and prosper. So, I'm pretty impressed so far. Seven holding his own, but again, every <coughs> minute that ticks by, this man's energy is being sapped. Same with Wes. Oh, heavy punch. Seven. Irish. Oh, springboard misses with the moonsault DDT. Wes clocks him on that one properly. Oh, and it explodes. How you doing, monster? The toughest <laughs> SOB on Mixer is here. How are you doing? No, thank Rex. You oh, sorry, thank you, man. Follow uh, Rex. Welcome to Swampy Dog Productions, and welcome to the end of Dog After Dark. Right now. <laughs> you are witnessing. Oh, I'm good, I'm good, my man. You are witnessing Wesley Wolf versus Seven in a uh, Maximus Special Reaper Challenge. Oh. Oh. And that's right. This match has barely started. Unfortunately, this is the last match of four shows we've done tonight. How many matches in total was that? Twenty-eight. Twenty-eight. Oh. No, twenty-four. Sorry. Oh, red arrow by Seven there. This is a four hundred. Plus without a man doing that kind of shit. Learned, he's learning that hell ninja shit from Maximus. Right? He takes hold of uh, Wes now. Drags him to the ropes. Ah, oh, slams his head on that top buckle. 17 minutes Look, just Wes went down. Versus him once more. Bows a punch. Seven's clever enough. Gets in the way. And that foot choke goes in. Oh, he stretches him up as much as he can. And Wes sinks in the corner. Some smell of cheese fills that corner of the ring. Don't know. Can't make the connection, but we'll just go with it. And oh, Wes! And look at the strum. Takes him down. Oof. And Wes fires up the crowd. Feels the adrenaline coursing. Thank you for that. Host there, Darth Fixer. I hope Darth you're doing well, Fixer sir. Darth Fixer is in the building. How are you doing, sir? Welcome to the last part of Dog After Dark. Nuka Thank girl. you for that follow, Nuka Girl. How are you doing? Welcome to the last part of Dog After Beautiful page. Wow. All right. Set for 17 minutes left. Isabella Bush could go wearing. There they all go now. <laughs> Try to stick to the show. Seven. All the same. Jumps off. Oh, the Phoenix Splash! Oh, my lord! Seven now sets Wes up. This is going to be the first finisher of this match. Surely. Seven takes him in. Oh, it goes up. The jackhammer. Thank the you, jackhammer. Seven. The jackhammer. Damn, he goes 1 0 to seven. seven takes the lead in <coughs> this Reaper match. Wes Wolf is now behind him. Once again, guys, thank you for joining us here. Fix is a Nuka Girl. Thank you for the follow. Whoever the other one was that gave the follow, the host. Thank you so much, guys. We have had a long night. We have done two Swampy Syndicate Wrestlings, and this is the last part of Dog After Dark tonight. We had a little mini Thanos moment. Luckily, the GM managed to save us, and we managed to pull it back. Thank you for joining us. I hope you had a good stream, Fixer. In fact, Fixer, I know you had a good stream because I switched over and saw over a thousand goddamn people in your channel. That's well deserved, brother. <laughs> I know you had a good stream. We the church indeed. It is seven of the church up against Johnson Johnson's poster boy, Wesley Wolf. And this, this is a Reaper title match. So that is a 20 minute Iron Man match where only finishers will score. Oh, Wesley Wolf going for an independent variable. No much love to you. You, mate, thank you for stopping by. Oh, Kenny the Kendo stick is into play. Future Future is future yeah, in. Oh, Kenny lands on the top of Seven's cranium. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, 
Welcome aboard, Future. I'm glad you're here, my man. I love you, bro. Well. I miss you, mate. I know you had a <laughs> pretty night tonight. Thank oh, you for stopping by. Oh, goes down now. Was that a bet? It was it? Was a claw? One in one. One all. Wes is now tied with Max. Oh, is that a week? Damn, and blood has been spilled already. We've got just the 15 Off minute mark. Wes into the ring now. It's one apiece. Wes is a bleeding. Oh, my lord. Oh, wait. Seven goes up to risk it for the biscuit. Oh, oh, nobody misses with that shot of combo drop. Fish me. <laughs> <laughs> but doesn't miss with that oh, rainbow oh, DDT. God damn. Ten pegs in with that DDT. Shark Week on <laughs> Thank you, Monster. Political correction there. Shark Week on God damn, I love you guys. Seriously. You can see the death of us most likely. Seven looks on. Wolf's shot is throwing. Oh, oh, the comeback train! Here's the comeback train! Rain in the heavy blows. Shark Week has shot. Irish Week off the road. Seven comes back in. Knee oh, drop. Oh, face. Buster Wes is down. Seven picks him up. What are we going to see? Oh, oh super kick. Boom! Oh, oh, surely, surely no. No, Wes comes back with an awesome barrier. My lord. Wes turns seven inside out with that manoeuvre, but, but seven with a back body drop. Wow. Seven ain't giving Wesley an inch, but Wesley bleeding, mixing with oil on that forehead, that beautiful, beautiful, shiny forehead. It's just not. Ooh, this is a fun boat too soon. <laughs> That's him, though. Wow. Ten pegs in with that DDT. That was amazing. <laughs> 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 oh, well, they are coming back with each other. Reversal after reversal. These two guys definitely want this belt. That's right. Where's this after this hard? Seven, though, with that lovely reverse DDT. Damn, takes him down. Oh, oh, he sets him up. Here, are we keeping count? It's one of his. And now oh, here he comes. Gosh. The jackhammer. Can Wes get out of it? He picks him up, he's up. How often do you see Ooh, Wes put in that two position? 2-1 two, and it's starting to get a little bit tense now. <laughs> Seven deciding perhaps to go, yep. He's going for an independent variable, but Wes... But Wes is Wes, around, he's going to go out after him. Wes knows the deal, oh, mate. Oh, the chair comes into play, but Wes stops it. Wes, oh, seven, though. He <laughs> flushes it straight down on top of that chair. Oh, I'm going to have the balky chair in the corner where the bell is moment. Wes just absolutely ate that chair on the floor. Wow, he's got Wes is up. Seven's still trying to get the chair next to the bell. Wes takes him down with a big butt. The oh. boot's even... <laughs> he is, yeah, yeah he, open that area up. He didn't like that chair, you see, Seven, so he went for the other one. Which, he's done it every time. He wants the one that Jojo's been sitting in. Possibly <laughs> to sniff it? I don't yeah, know. I don't know. Charlie might go to the Jojo's. I think Charlie will do what she's told. Good acolyte. Like a good acolyte. <laughs> yeah, oh, maybe. where's Black Elbows right into the face? Oh, who's oh, then a heavy overhanded punch, Charlie's daughter. Okay. Ah, yeah, we might need to backtrack a little bit about that. Nah, <laughs> we're about to track on that one. I'm not talking incestuous church. Oh, he misses that. Oh, that oh, never punch. Oh, wow. Whoa! Trying to slap the smack out of oh, Wes. Oh, little man. That was awesome. Oh, so sweet. Chin music. Oh, oh, oh. That kick even took it out of seven. It was a <coughs> violent. <coughs> Where's the slap? Oh, no. You just cannot stop this man. No matter how hard you hit him, he just keeps getting And he up. goes on. That's two apiece. Two apiece. We're at 11 minutes, 40 seconds of this Reaper match. You don't get any damn closer. Oh, Wes is already busted open. Seven is it? not that far off. Yeah, but he's not far off. He's coming back those heavy blows, though. Everyone's taking his toll on Wes at the same time. Tells him to have some iron in his diet. Oh, leaves him draped on the... Oh, as I was saying, left him draped on the post, but no, he changed his mind. I mean, Seven is normally known for being quite a bit of a merciless bastard, but tonight he's holding nothing oh, back, is he? Oh, wow. No, he's he picks him up. Turns him round, blue thunder bomb. And I think that was ding, another ding, one. Ding, 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 indeed. That's three, two to seven. Seven takes the lead again, but I don't think Wes is going to be too far <coughs> behind him. He's not keeping up with him, blow for blow at the moment. Wes starting to throw those heavy, heavy blows now. Can seven come back? Wes ducks underneath. Uh oh, takes him round, pulls his arm round. Seven. Oh, the forearm. Wow. Both these guys absolutely refusing to relent. Oh, relent. Wes with a heavy uppercut. The seven again counts it. Oh, the double! Wow, the double landing! Wow, these two behemoths locking heads, horns and everything right here. Oh, I'm trying it again, but he wasn't that lucky. Wes clocks him, throws the heavy punch, oh, oh rolls him round. Neck breaker! Oh, I 
I'm surprised Seven's head didn't come clean damn off with that manoeuvre. Oh, wait. Wait, what's going on? No! Oh, the lights go down! He appears without an Irish Richmond! Misses, though, with that move! Where's... Yes, Conrad! With the Russian leg sweep! And that was a complete balk of the blackout system. Didn't hit his finisher there. Where's just too damn soapy and slippy to hold on oh, to? Oh, drives him back down. Oh, no. Oh, my lord. Where's no? He calls him to his feet. The grease one is flying. Where's no? Where's no, 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 no. No, where's... Where's... Oh, oh the just misses, though. Kirk where's is denied. Where's that? Doesn't post that one. Oh. Uh, counters this punch. Ah, oh, the bread basket taken in. What an absolute slobber knocker. We are now. Oh, Seven takes him up. What are we about to see? F5. Oh, right on that metal part. And the Seven really. <laughs> and right on that metal part of the ramp. But it's still alive, still breathing. Seven, was that a finish for the can I ask? No, thank oh, God. Right. That, that was one. So that's <laughs> up, three apiece. Three apiece, and again, it doesn't get any closer. We're approaching nine minutes. It's still anyone's match. Can Seven defend, or is West going to be Oh, Seven's turn to slap the snot out of Seven. Uh, sorry, Wolf's turn Wolf's to slap the snot out of Seven. <laughs> West, oh, no. oh, stomach shot. Oh, I'm not afraid of DDT. Right on the oh. hard metal. Oh. Seven oh. trying to kill Wesley Wolf here. Oh. Wow, I mean, if Wes hasn't got some damage to his head by the end of this match, I'll be shocked. Well, Wes is a turf motherfucker, but I mean, <coughs> Seven is doing everything he can to keep this man down. He's still not even bleeding yet. Oh, Wes counters, sweeps him down, rolls him over. No, does. Oh, lands the kick of the hamstring. Wes oh, said, I have had enough of your hijinks, motherfucker. But, but Seven catches him once seven again. Seven will not relent. Definitely got his game face on today. One of the best Reaper matches we've seen so far. These two behemoths continue to trade oh, blow for blow. Oh, Wes again. Put Seven in the corner. Oh, no. Oh, no. Driven into that corner place. Oh, shoulders must be hurting. Look at the anger on Wes's heavy bleeding knee face. Raining down on him. Wes is pissed off. He's sweaty. He's tired. He's bleeding. He's hurt. He wants this to be over oh, with. Round has that neck breaker again. Oh. Seven just will not die. And same to the point. Wesley just and will... again. Oh, oh it's seven. Oh, that was one. That was one, though. So now I think Wesley is Wesley taking the lead. Four, oh, and live long and prosper to seven shoulder. Seven must realise the urgency. Seven minutes and 40 left on the clock. It's still anyone's game for now, but when we get to those dying minutes, I reckon it's going to be a... Oh, oh that back elbow drop. Oof, look again, the fatigue is well and truly setting in. And I mean, when you're wearing that much seven, leather... Seven counters away. Oof, it must be hot underneath. Sets minutes. Wes up. No what way. are we going to see? There's that urgency I was talking about, Swamp. He takes him under. He's going to pick him up and he's going to be the... Oh, here he comes. Oh, Jack I'm Hammer. Jack Rolling Hammer. Rolling brain buster. Four apiece. Four apiece. Seven not content though. He picks and wet. Wes back up. And remember, guys, if it ends Grant in the Tolly. tie... The... Irish whips him into the corner. Oof. Tie matches. Wes next. turns around straight away, though. Seven ducks and knees. Belly kick. Uh, uh, no. <coughs> seven. Oh, not again. Seven. No, 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 no. Seven. Seven. The red arrow again from the top rope. Retract my nose. Well done, brother. Nice one. But <laughs> Wes, straight up. Wes says, take your flying shit and stuff it where the sun don't shine. Oh, he rolls him around with that neck break. And once again. Think... Wes has taken the lead, 6 Five, minutes four. 30 on the clock, it don't get much closer than this, 7 is furious! Oh, no, party in the corner, oh there he goes, continuous strike, 7 now, throwing the boots in as well. Wes slips up, almost immediately! Ah, oh, 7 reverses him down. Between the fatigue, the blood loss and everything, Wes is really having to double his efforts here, but he's still in, well, oof, oof. Still got his head in the corner then, I suppose. Super King! <laughs> Look at him, he's spent. He knows he's working for this title. He knows it. No. Once again, he goes up top. I don't think he's going to pull this off the third time. If he does, you can tell that Wes is going to be... Oh, no, oh, no. he's going to call for him this time. He wants him standing. Oh, dear. Wes there stands. He can he see it coming? Oh, Wes catches him. Power bomb down. 
Seven taking that risk too far. Didn't I fucking say? Didn't I? Didn't I? now turns him round into that corner. No seven ducks. Oh. Dives, dodges, and punts him over the top rope. But I'll use that for one Sam. Even though I'm Fair enough. Five. five minutes twenty left on the clock. And we are five, five, five on four. Oh my God! This is going to be one of those ones, isn't it, Swamp? Oh! oh. Slams him down with that strong once again. Oh. Where's going for an independent variable under the ring? What will he find? What will he find? He's not found anything as of yet. He doesn't find a thing. Wow. I mean, we really need to top the, the ring up with weapons, maybe. Oh, yeah, I swear, it's pretty stacked. Well, unless, unless Catbox has been there making things PG friendly. Yeah. I'm gonna Keep bringing back the PG to the syndicate. It's not going to happen. I'm going to skin that Catbox. Oh, oh, trust me, I was doing the same. Right. Where's now? Throws seven back into the centre of the ring. He wants to finish it here. Oh, he stands him up. Are we going to see the first claw of the night, do you think? I Oh no, no, he rolls around for that neck breaker again. Oh, Down it goes, ding West. ding, it's six four. Takes. I think it may be a lot higher than that, so yeah. I didn't realise that was a finisher. Oof. We're going to find out near the end regardless. It is four minutes, 20 seconds left on the clock. Where well, goes to the other side this time, looking for a different item. He is damn determined to find himself an independent variable. And he uh, comes out with a hammer. I had a hammer. He'd hammer in the morning. I have her in the evening and he'll have her up. He got seven seconds oh. more and uses that hammer at the same time, trapping Wes's his head with it. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. Seven literally used the, the hammer. He's the using this, isn't he? Isn't it? Right? Seven, he's going to hit it. Oh. He hits it again. Yes. again, lands it with Wes straight back up. I mean... Seven, mate, you are running out of time. Four oh, minutes, 30 seconds. Right. You are two down. If you can pull off the tie, remember, the reigning champion will retain. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, no, that, one that one wasn't. Oh, he had that <laughs> Wes, I don't know how many times he's done that, but he's calling for the end once again. Seven, That's seven, seven. seven. No. no. He's still got fight in him. He knows he's one down. Says yet, my Two friend. down, in fact. He's going to go to work. Three minutes approaching on the clock. Wes refusing to die, blood pissing into his eyes. He oh, he catches him. No. Oh. Ding, ding. It's 7-4. Seven, 7-4. Four. Seven, four. And Wesley Wolf takes a decisive lead <coughs> over 7. And he still isn't bleeding to his credit. Goes the stomp down. 7, though. Irish River. Rose over the top rope. Takes a hold of him. Uh -oh. oh no. Oh, Chang Pang. Jeez, he's at the edge of that craven. Oh wow. Super 10 peg to Wes, but it's not enough. He's still fighting back. That's two minutes 40 on the clock. Needs to come back three at least for the draw. Wes dashes him back into the ring, follows him up. There's weapons strewn everywhere. There's blood pissing everywhere. This has been a hell of a Reaper match. Seven knows it. Wolf definitely oh, knows it. Oh, throwing heavy hose. Oh, cross wires. And uh -oh. Wesley catches oh, him again. No, neck breaker. Down he goes. He literally loves that move, doesn't he? Wow. Oh, uh, he's, he's got his hammer. Oh, oh he hammers this boy. Oh, taking a page from Triple H. Oh, he's and then... back out. Obviously, wasn't happy with the fact that he got used against him originally. Always get rid of the fucking yeah, evidence. Rolls around. And there it is. Yet again, a neck breaker seven. If he does survive this, it's going to be an absolute torture. This man's going to be able to rotate. Yeah, this man's going to be able to rotate his head for. I think you might have to call him an owl, after. right? Church of owls. 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 <laughs> so burning. Boom! And one minute thirty approaching on the clock, and you are right, Mr. Future Endeavors. The oh. hill has turned into Mount. Fucking Everest right now. Seven has got work to do. If he can do it, it's going to be a miracle. Turns him round. We're going to oh. see him pretty. Oh, what a move! Seven oh, sets him up. Finally, we might see it. <coughs> is Wes going to have the sense to kick out of it? I don't think he is. He's lifted up into the chest. And that is down he goes. Rolling brainbuster. Oh, seven five. Seven five. We think. <laughs> Possibly more. Possibly more. But Wes absolutely refusing to die. It is the last minute, 55 seconds left on the clock. It has been an absolute slobber knocker. Wes has tried to kill Seven for He's his title He's tearing his neck off. The muscles in the back of... Ah, oh, another one. Crunch. Oh. 
I think it's safe to say, unless Seven has literally... Oh, no, another one! Let's neck break. Okay, yes, I have a breaker. I have a neck breaker. Oh, shit! We Finally, just at the end, Seven is busting open. <coughs> GG, at least he didn't go down that easy. My God. No way. Rolls around. Throws the blows in. Where's counters? Oh. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Cats and sacks. We always say the Reaper Belt is a strange picky mistress. She is picked. Bruce Lightning tonight to be worn around. So give it up for him. Let's get some GGs in the chat, please, guys. What a Reaper match of the heart. These two literally tried to kill one another in this one. It almost became personal. Wow. And our greatest fears have been realised. Reese Lightning has been in possession of the Reaper. Yes. He has to defend this another nine times to be able to change the stipulation. And we said if there is a man that can beat Maximus's challenge, it will surely be Wesley Paul. A premonition perhaps, Cats and Sacks? We don't know. All I do know is, bloody battered and bruised. That is your new Reaper champion, GG Wesley Wall. And guys, GG7, what about? He fucking, he didn't go down the way out of fight. That man could have literally had his arms and legs broken and he would have been <laughs> entering <laughs> him on the floor. How you doing, one, Brent? Wow. And yes, Monster, <laughs> I would expect you win your match tonight, mate, before you got here. Butch's block to escape the cage. You sent the message that you're ready to get the ball again, mate. Wow, good tunage. Cats and sacks. I know a lot of you have just joined us now. We really appreciate it. It's always good to see you there. We have been going for... It's no point doing enough time. We have, we have had to reset the stream several times because we had lag issues. But this we have been going so about so eight, so at, about so seven and a half, nearly approaching eight hours. We started a while ago. We did two Swampy Syndicates, two Dog After Darks. It's been an emotional night, basically a pay-per-view without it being a pay-per-view. Once again, thank you to all of our God Mods for doing what you do and making this place safe. Thank you to all our viewers it. for coming in. I hope you all had a wonderful time. I hope so Minus too. the botches and the borks and the uh, mixer be not behaving, or should I say light stream not behaving. Mm -hmm. Thank you to all of you new followers as well. Again, we appreciate you. Come back and join us next week when we will be going back to normal scheduling times without the Thanos interruptions, touch hopefully, touch wood. I might very well be doing one. Well, no, I think there's a very real chance on Swampy Syndicate tomorrow we'll be hitting some Blackout, maybe some Apex, who knows? Looking after Mini Swampy. But however, tonight, wow, I'd say it's been an emotional one, Swamp. We've had some absolutely amazing Lots moments. Guys, check the VODs out. Seriously. Please, yes, check the VODs see it out. Well, check the VODs. We've got to hope the VODs have made it there. We have yeah, reset a long wood. time. Touch wood. But once again, thank you to everybody. Thank you to all of the new followers. Thank you to our all regulars. Our regulars. Thank you you to don't all know what it means here. when we see your names come up in that chat. You know, it means you're coming back. We're happy to see you. So I'll not stretch it out. We're tired. We need to, we need to relax. I need to go home. So this man right here, this Ginger Day Walker, this is your GM and creator of this fine product, Swampy Dog. I am the Sandman, you are the viewers, and this was Dog After Dark and Swampy Syndicate Wrestling. Whatever you do with the rest of your Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, you enjoy it. Meet us back here, we'll most likely see you for Great One Stream coming up on Friday and tomorrow, in fact, <laughs> Wednesday. God. Indeed, late but here, yeah. Late but we know here. It, Monster, we know. Taking a we page out. It, doesn't matter what. Yeah, standing in for Here We Go Again, yo, with Mark being late all the time as well. Good to see you keeping up the spirits there, Monster. But once again, guys, we're not going to drag it out. Thank you for stopping by. Big thank you to Fix for stopping by after his long ass Thanks stream. Thanks for the host, guys. And we appreciate it. We will see you back here again on Swampy Syndicate Wrestling next week. So from all of us here at SDP, good night. Farewell. Take care. Stay frosty. And see you soon. Bye-bye. Night-night. Oh.